Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ephanias' Allies, and I had over the weekend the chance to go to the local powwow. While I was there, as you can see, yes, this is real, do not judge me. I have my hair backles, which my lovely friend Rocco from Roaming with Rocco purchased for me. He went with me. Um, I bought this necklace from the Lenape. Um, sorry about the lighting. Maybe I'll just go ahead and move over there and take all my stuff over there with me. Um, I might just go ahead and do that. Yeah. Um, I'm a little tired. Two days of powwow. That'll do it to you. But it's a good thing. It's a good thing. So one thing I did get from there was this big old roll of artificial sinew. That's going to last for a while. Make sure I get that. Oh, yeah, I do. Um, oh, yeah, I can't lose those. Oh, also from my line of pee friends. Well, now they call me sister. Um, is the earring. I got from them. They are such wonderful people. This will go to my friend Doug Paulson. He also has Native American lineage. So this is his birthday gift. And sorry guys, I'm just really tired right now. Two days of powwow. I'll show you my regalia in a few. This, my friend, right, it has a wolf on it. It's so beautiful. If you know what that is, it's a bone tool. And yes, it is real bone. It's a uh, elk bone. So, uh, Somebody did go hunting, and I had the chance to get elk bone. And it was made into a real tool. So, um, and I'm just really tired, so I just needed to sit in a really comfy spot. And yes, I did use my dress form um, for making my regalia. And I'll be making new regalia next year. But I promise you guys I would show you my regalia. So um, I'm actually going to do that. So let me stand up. And I'll move over here. I promised my uh, Lenape friends that I would wear my regalia today. I didn't wear it yesterday. I wore the dress that I got from Wally World. Native American uh, hangout there, Wally World. Um, I'm picking that up from uh, Joaquin Low Lodge. <laughs> Making regal. It always says Wally World. Um, so, yeah. So, let me. Uh, Take you guys over here to the desk where there's more light. Step into the light, Carolyn. Step into the light. Uh, so now that I have you guys over here, let me move that. I will step back. Ow, gotta move the fan. Because it's been really hot out. And take my phone off. The belt came in handy for my phone, though. Came in handy for my phone. Um, so that was no big deal. I just have to readjust this. It's like this part is on me weird right now. Um, so it turned out really good. And, uh, yeah. And so let me grab this stuff over here real quick. And we'll come over here and talk. So 
so anyway, now that I'm in better light at the view over here, anyway, <laughs> we'll get down to letting you see this stuff better. Even this and my hair backles. Um, because that's what they're called. And if you wonder how to take these off, there's a bead right here. Slide the bead down and you just take the leather and take it like that. Um, they're just crisscrossed. And then you take that back on the backle when you're not too tired, right? Just take it back on the backle and then take the bead and take it back up. And that's all there is to it. And just, you know, tighten that in your hair. So, uh, so this is what I got for my friend Doug Paulson. I don't know if you can see. Oh, there, you know, you can see the face in that. Just turn it towards the light. Excuse me. Um, so this is actually a men's necklace. It was his birthday over the weekend. So happy birthday, Doug. <laughs> um, like I said, I got my earrings. Um, the Navajo. I have a Navajo friend there that I now call brother. We, he calls me sister. I call him brother. I've been braiding his hair. Um, hopefully I catch him on next weekend's powwow. In another area because he asked me if I was gonna go so I could braid his hair um, like I said I got this from my Lena P friends they're they're now like sisters to me um, and also from my Navajo brother isn't that beautiful and it matches my regalia and I made my regalia like I said then I bought this this is Lenape. Um, don't judge me because it's real. It was from a hunt. Um, what else is Lenape that I have? Now, Lenape actually originated out of PA. But they were pushed over here to New Jersey. Uh, here, let me put this in a better light for you. Now, um, I bought these earrings, but they also match my regalia rather well, so I can wear these, and they go awesome with my tan. Oh my gosh, I was so surprised, like, I'm not really one to wear any gold colors, but these, like, really match my regalia. There you go. Oh my gosh. I love that with this regalia. Oh, am I going to have to base my next regalia on these earrings? Choose. Base my next regalia on these earrings. Which I love anyway. These could be an everyday thing. Or base my re next regalia on these earrings. Which... I think I need to base them on this. Um, oh my god. It's kind of hard to choose though. Maybe like during one day I wear these. The next day I wear these. I don't know. It's a choice. Maybe I'll just need to get an extra ear piercing. And then like wear the smaller ones up here. And the bigger ones down here. Which you know what? Oh. Why didn't I think about this? Because I already have that in this ear. Why did I not think about this? And we'll go into the patches and then I have something from another one. And I'll show you guys that, that uh, bone knife, which I'm going to be using for something else anyway. Um, and then I, like I said, I promised you guys I'd show you my regalia. I'm not doing a live stream with this because I'm tired and I just want to do this and upload and relax. 
relax. Get to relax and I hope that that ear hole didn't close off. I just have to pop it back open. It worked with an earring earlier. I wonder what's up with that. Worked with one of these earrings earlier. That, that's really weird. It worked with one of these earrings earlier. And what's up with that? Okay, well, anyway. That's weird. Maybe I have to get repairs. Anyway, that's what this regalia looks like with these earrings. Oh, that's beautiful. It's beautimous. Got my hair backles. I've got this. I've got my regalia. <sighs> okay, and then I'm ex excited to do new regalia for next year. Okay, on to these, like I said. Okay, so I've got these, which I'm trying to figure out what to do with. Like, I would do some sort of, like, hair thing, but I'm not sure I want to do that. We could do some sort of hair backle thing, but I have smaller ones. I have the smaller matching ones. That would mean I'd have to be, like, doing a whole bunch of, like, a whole bunch of, for just one hair backle. Or maybe just, ooh, I might have an idea. I'm not sure that that would match with this. I'm not sure it would match with that. I might have to figure this out. Um, but I do know that this, oops, don't want to lose a medicine wheel. This, my friends, is going to be a bracelet. Tell me that's not going to be a gorgeous bracelet. Right? 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 Yeah, that's going to be a gorgeous bracelet. And then these are going to be the little sides to the bracelet, which is going to be amazingly cool. Soon I will learn how to do the peyote stitch. Some people call it peyote stitch. Peyote. <laughs> Is a shroom. <laughs> Peyote is a shroom. Um, I'm loving these earrings the more I'm wearing them. <laughs> About you. But I think I'm loving the earring. I love these too. I was like, I was attracted to these too. Like, I braided his hair and got these for free. Thank you, brother. Um, and I braided his hair yesterday and got three necklaces for free. Thank you, brother. Um, so, yeah. Um, I'm going to take these and make them into the bracelet, which I think is going to be gorgeous. Um, and then this... I'm going to take the medicine wheel pieces. Of course, I'm going to put this in the right direction. So just work with me because I'm just tired here. <laughs> and make these into a choker piece. I'm going to make these into a choker piece. I think that's going to be amazingly cool. That's going to be so cool. Nobody, nobody at the powwow is going to have that, but moi. Oh, unless my Lena P sisters want that. Then I have to make it for them, too. They make the patches, I make the jewelry. <laughs> um, that's the way it works, girls. That's the way it works. But this... I have to figure out what do I want to do with this because it's not like I can just like make something and then just wear it in my hair like that. I don't think. Although that looks kind of cool.
Hey, look, I, I'm, I'm kind of a warrior myself, but it's mostly warriors that wear the pieces like that. Oh, there was a sweet elder. She was there last year. And she just wore the uh, the pieces just like in her hair backles. It's like right here in her hair backles. She had like one of the bigger patches here. And she had a bigger patch on the other side. You know, with the hair backle. And, um... She looked really pretty. And like, I'm trying to think like, would that look really cool? Like something like that? We'll have to decide. I may have to get something and just like maybe, yeah, we'll have to figure this out. I need to figure out what I want to do with this. Ooh, no, I don't know. Wait, guys, I may have to turn this into like a big hair clip thing. You know what I mean? It's like some big hair clip. And just like wear it on the back of my head. Oh. Okay, I have like Native American ideas just running in my head, like big old hair clip, just like right here on the back of my head. Oh, and that might work out. Like the one piece for my hand, the other one for here, and this in my hair. It could work. I'll make this work. Oh my gosh. I'm going to make this work. We can make this work. Because this is like. So traditional. Like. This is great. Okay. Moving on to something else. So like they had other vendors there. <clears throat> One guy seemed to have had a crush on me. He was kind of funny. Um. You know, he kept telling me that, oh, come back to my table. It's like, we can barter for something. Sorry, sweetie, I'm not bartering for that. Um, there's enough hoes around here, and I'm not one of them. <laughs> okay, but there's this company that was there. I think that's the name of their company. Give them a little shout out there. Um, but they have these really cool, they have these really cool items. Like, right? Tell me those aren't cool. Right? And apparently they have it. So like if you have a party at your house and so many people show up, you get a free item. So like whatever is there, you get a free item. Um, I think that's cool. <sighs> I love, 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 love the sugar skull and the cattle skull. Those so cool. Like I actually got to see those. This is a pretty nice size. And I think this little camper right here, that was so cute. It had some cuteness. Um, those were so cool. Uh, although they had a bunch of other things there that were also some really cool. Um, there were like selective things that I like. Wait, makeup by Casey, pineapple. Anyway. It is. It's funny. Uh, but anyway, 
this is really cool. When I got this, but let's look at this side of this roll of artificial sinew. Like, you know how much this would cost in a regular store? Like 25, 30 bucks for that roll. Okay, but this, that is gorgeous. It's made out of elk bone. It's real. Okay, but what I actually plan on using this for is a leather tool. Plan on using this for a leather tool. Sorry, guys. I'm seriously tired. My energy is seriously low. Um, probably part of the reason because I kept a young man from interrupting the ceremony today and we're not just going to go into it but his mom was very happy that I stopped in and you know you know I don't think he'll be doing things like that anymore so um and People were just happy that I stopped somebody from messing up the day. Um, so with that said, remember, um, what you keep in here, remember to keep it going to the white light because when you let people interfere with your soul, they ca have control over you, don't have control over yourself. Um, and that's when you need to release what is holding you back. And, and never let people like hold you back from what's truly your inspiration for what you want to do in life, your path in life. And, and this is what I was explaining to this young man. And he fully understood. And I handed him one of the, the extra crystals out of my medicine bag. And he, the young man started to cry. I'm going to tell you that. The young man started to cry. Um, but... You know, in the end of that, you know, everything turned out okay. It all turned out okay. And he calmed down. And you know what, though? His whole demeanor changed. Just like he went from angry to crying and happy. And his mom noticed a huge change in him. She was like standing right there. I wouldn't listen to her. But he changed in an instant because somebody talked some sense into him. What would it what would it do? What good would it do for you to hurt somebody or a lot of people and what does that do for your soul? What good is that for your soul? And he was like, yes, ma'am. It wouldn't do my soul any good. And I'm like, you need to let that anger go. Let it go. Because it's not who you are. And he let it go. You let it go. And when somebody holds you back and makes you angry for something you really aren't, when you aren't what somebody made you into, you, you know you can make your own path in life. You know this. And you know you can make a good path in your life. And that's what I got that young man to do today. Instead of being destructive at the powwow. His, 
his family that was there thanked me for calming him down. They've never been able to do that. Never been able to calm him down. Somebody was finally able to do it. And he broke down and started crying. So think about that. What good does that do the soul? Right? Right? So keep your, your soul happy, healthy, positive, and as always, stay blessed. And I will see you guys next time. Probably not dressed in my regalia, but I was so happy to be able to show it to you because the energy there was just so wonderful that I'm glad that I can share things with you. And I'm loving these rings even more. Um, just share the blessed energy of positivity and it goes a lot further in life then you realize, um, because that's what keeps uh, life going in the right direction, and it takes you places. So um, I'll see you all later.